What's up, y'all? It's your boy, JC. Welcome back to another video, man. Um, soaking wet, my bad. I just came back from my run, but let me get y'all caught up on what you missed out on these last couple weeks. A couple weeks ago, I had a hard brake line pop on me on the highway. Uh, it was real sketchy. Basically, what happened was um, this hard line was rubbing up against the axle and over time just caused the leak until it just blew up. But I was able to limp off the highway with just rear brakes into a plaza, park it, and call, you know, CAA. Um, got it to my boy Eric's shop. He was able to fix it up for me. And now it has a bracket supporting that hard line to the chassis to prevent it from happening again. Also did some exhaust work with my uncle and uh, HP exhaust, but um, I've been told that it's pretty quiet, so I'm not even gonna bother showing you guys. And also spent about a good week just touching up some rusty areas underneath the car with my POR15 and high build stone guard treatment. And then a week after that, I tried to fix this wing on with just some double-sided tape, but um, the clamps kept sliding off the sides. Um, every time I held a side down, one side kept uh, propping up, um, so, you know, finally I gave up and just, you know, screw it, run wingless. Because if you, if you know, um, the GTI wings actually come with like GTI glass that's all drilled and that's how it's mounted. But in this case, the uh, bolts have been stripped off. So I was going to try using a uh, double-sided tape, but that didn't work. So um, just hold on to it for now. If uh, y'all can hook me up with some ideas. I'm open to listening. Um. Finally, I know I have a slow leak somewhere. So I was checking my oil and I was trying to check the uh, gear oil from the speedometer cable and um, ended up breaking this 11 mil bolt. So right now what I have is a sock wrapped around the bottom of that stock to keep the plate from lifting and just to kind of absorb and soak up like any fluid that might come up from the, from the trans. But, um, Today we're going to pay the homie Andrew a visit and he's going to help us out with that bolt and um, figure it out. So uh, let's get it. What'd you end up using? Is it this one? Yeah. Let's do it. Good job, man. <laughs> All right, man, we back home. Shouts to Andrew. Uh, no leaks. And um, he showed me how to fit that gasket underneath. I, I never had that for the time I've had the car. So um, also supplied me with a new bolt. So shouts to Andrew, man. Thanks for helping me out. So yeah, uh, stay tuned. Um, we're gonna do a more in-depth video of um, one of Andrew's cars because he's got so many. He's got dudes got like four cars, but what a what a nice guy, man. Um, always down to help. Uh, always down to lend a hand. Actually, we I have a lot of friends in this old school dub community that are like that, right? And, and I'm really trying to find the time to you know align some schedules and really um, feature more of their cars too. But um. As of right now, we're standing at 976 subscribers, I believe. So just a few more subs until we hit the thousand subscriber mark. I, I gotta, once again, thank you guys for um, riding with me from, from the start. I am gonna raffle out a shirt with a design, which was drawn up by my cousin. Um, check this design out, probably gonna throw it on a black shirt or something, um, throw some branding on it and raffle it out to um a subscriber at a thousand subs so um stay tuned for the announcement for that if you haven't already please follow me on instagram and um until next time y'all i love you see you some boy